we had Tupac Dad on the platform, and he spoke about, you know, the situation that happened in Vegas. And he said that, you know, he felt like Tupac, he was being watched by the government the night that he was shot. And he also said that he felt like Tupac was set up. How you feel about them comments being made by Tupac Dad? Keefe D confessed to the United States government in a proffer agreement to handing his nephew Orlando Anderson the gun that ultimately killed your son Tupac Shakur. After Orlando was jumped at the MGM Grand, you've never spoken on this. How does that make you feel that he confessed to that and the government gave him a deal? Well, I think the key question there is the government. The government gave him the deal. The same, he was being tailed by the government the night of his assassination. He was being tailed by the government quad studio. That's a known fact. Known fact. So I don't know this guy, Keith. I, I don't know. Maybe he had to say that to get out of some issues. I don't know. I just know it looked like a setup to me. To a, to, what, 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 Tupac's the government. Uh, what the government going to kill them for? Who is he? To, what would the government kill them for? What would the government kill them for? That don't make sense. Why would the government kill him, bro? Come on, big dog. He that fucking powerful. Come on, man. That don't make no fucking sense. Like he Putin or some fucking body. Vladimir Putin. Come on, man. Come on now. You know what I'm saying? Government had him on the hit list. Come on, man. It, 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 that don't even sound right, man. Conspiracy theorists. You know what I'm saying? Like I say, the feds don't come knock on your door unless they got your ass. They, they, get, they got your ass by the balls. They, and their conviction rate is 99%. And I don't have a billion dollars. And he don't have a billion dollars. Tupac Daddy don't know how the feds work. You know what I'm saying? You know, that's his opinion. Big dog. Let me tell you something, my brother. Tupac them jumped on him. He was by himself. He didn't just, my nephew never jumped on no fucking Tupac. Come on, man. Tupac was wrong with two left fucking shoes, nigga. I mean, two, don't you think he was wrong? Honestly. I mean, um, yeah, I think he could have, you know, reacted in a better way. You, you, listen, homie. You don't think that man is wrong? He could have reacted in a better way, I guess. I mean. I'm talking about Vlad is his fucking biggest fan. He admitted that that man is wrong, man. I mean, yeah, man. I mean, he Come was on, wrong, man. man. But that was only done out of loyalty, man. Okay, thank you. I appreciate that. Come on, he, he never jumped. Uh, my nephew didn't jump on him. He jumped on my nephew, was a, a kid, man. My nephew was a fucking kid. Them was grown ass men, dude. You know what I'm saying? He was a fucking kid, dude. That's why he had on that jersey. He was a fucking kid, dude. You know what I'm saying? They was wrong. My nephew never jumped on him. They jumped on my nephew. My nephew didn't throw a punch, man. Shit was wrong, dude. Jumped on the fucking kid, dude. And if I'm not mistaken, Orlando, he hurt his shoulder, right? Yeah, they, they kicked his shoulder and he went to the hospital, big dog. Yeah, he. They kicked his shoulder and he went to the hospital, yeah. Sure. What exactly was wrong with his shoulder? They just, they put him on the uh, sort of slang. Gave him a slang. Yeah, they gave him a slang, yeah. Yeah.